What about fire? I mean they're vampires, right? They probably don't like fire. Stop it. What? What killed her? Is there someone else? My immense skill, that's what killed her. My attacks are so strong they die before I even hit. Vampire dust. I'm hearing something. Who's there? I'm hearing a voice. Dust I'll take. Right, there's gonna be somebody else. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Get him Mazoga, get his attention. Ow. Fire is shooting. Let's get this over. This is the part where you fall down and bleak. Ow. Well, we've got him cornered at least. Gosh, he's tough, isn't he? Don't do that. Die, You're supposed to die. Okay. This is the part where you fall down and uh, bleed I've to death. Ow. Ack, stop doing that. Yeah. I could actually use a bit of help here, Mazoga. Oh, God. Hey, hey, hey. Knock him down again. Okay. I don't want any of this. Right, that's everything. Let's continue on then. Open easy lock tome. I mean, I don't really have any issue with easy locks. These are gonna be too heavy aren't they? Gold I'll take. Ooh a key. And a soul gem. The locked room. Paul Gerd's tail. I don't have either of these. Potions I'll take. 
Oh dear, who was this one then? K. And that just leads back out I'm guessing. I think I know where this leads. Yeah, I think we're done then. God that scared me I forgot they were there. Okay. Yeah we're done. All of them are dead. Good. Hey, take whatever you want. It's none of my business. All right. All done, you big wimps. Hello. Hello. What? You've killed the vampires? Yes, I have. What? All of them? All of them. Let me see your neck. You, you, you look safe. But did you find Sticks or Darius? I found them both. And they're dead. Very, very dead. Show some respect for God's sakes! Those were two of my best! I'm sorry, dude. But at least they died human. I guess. Anyways, thanks. You have done far more than I expected. What about the bit man? He probably will turn you know. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing. If he can control himself I'm sure he'll be fine. Not like he needs to be out in the daylight as a miner. Uh, he'll be fine. We'll get him to the nearest chapel tonight. Okay. Now, I believe I owe you a favor, madam. True, you do owe me a favor. A tunnel-shaped favor, I would say. Alright. I suppose we owe you that much, at least. After we heal up, I'll get the men working on it. Check back in a week or so. It'll take us that long, at least. Alright. Better yet, I'll send word to the Archaeology Guild when it's complete, alright? Sounds good. Cool. Thanks, man. Hey, watch your back. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh. You actually did put a head on the spike. Where did you get this one from? See you, Squeaky, or whatever the hell you were called. Ooh, I can't steal from him right in front of them. Well, we're done in here, I suppose. So it's off to Shaden Hall next. This way is it? Yes. Okay. Right. All in a day's work, eh, Mazoga? We've got to sell a lot of junk when we get back to the city. And, um, yeah, we're gonna look out for a different outfit for you, I think. Okay, here we are. Hello. Who's left their horse right there? How annoying. Time to relax. Yeah, we can relax a bit. Let's head to the blacksmith first. Hi there. Oh, it's hey you. you. Mazoga. Come on, Mazoga. What a shame. Absolutely. Okay, very good. A pleasure to serve you. Of course it is. Um, I don't suppose you've heard of someone called Aranar, or maybe Ilnori? You haven't heard of anyone called Aranar, but you remember Makna mentioning something about an Ilnori. Makna, okay. Thanks for that. Take care. Makna, I assume that's... Wait, am I over-encumbered? Yes, I am. Uh, help. What can I do for you? 
Tell you what, we're making the big bucks here, aren't we? Thank you for your patronage. Thank you. Be seeing ya. Okay, I think we're looking for an Argonian. I don't actually remember seeing an Argonian here. Afternoon. Afternoon. Hmm. Let's just check everyone. It's you. How delightful. Ah. What's your name? No, not you. What was the name again? Oh, it's the owner of the local bookshop. Right, I remember her now. Bookshop, here we go. Mac Nas Books. Hello there. What do you want? I'm looking for Ilnori. I heard you might know them. You know him. But that's just his pen name, you're not sure of his real name. You helped him find a publisher for his book. You believe he's living in a small cottage just east of the city, but he keeps mostly to himself, so you can't be sure. Young Adria seems to be up there a lot though, always talking about her wonderful Mulverian. You wonder if that's his real name. Mulverian, okay. Thanks. Take care. Mulverian. Hmm. Right, we'll go look for him then. First, let's go to the Major's Guild and recharge our weapons. He lives just east of the city. Evening. There is an east gate, right? Yeah, it's over there, I'm pretty sure. You know, over to the east. East gate. I don't think I've ever used the east gate, you know. Hmm, I'm sure she'll catch up. So, I guess just follow the path. There are people here. Are they friendly people? Why are there so many people out here? Looks like you're handy with a blade. Looks like you're handy with a blade. Well, this isn't a house. This is a fort. I don't think this is right. Hmm, we are high up though. Let's see if we can spot a house. Hmm. Oh, is that a path? There's a house. Wow, easy there mate. Mazoga, are you here? And a wolf? Stop it. Mazoga, help. Is someone shooting me? Yes. Time to relax. How annoying. Oh, you looted everything. Fair enough. Where's the other one? Might need to make your parameters a bit stricter. Blade Weaver Warblade. Meh, I don't really want that. Okay, well I'm guessing this is the house then. Hello. She's there. Oh, oh. I'm going to bleed slow. No! Oh gods, they cornered me. I can you'll never take me down. Yeah. Oh. Oh. 
I'm also out of health potions. Which isn't great. A charred female corpse. Oh dear. Hmm. Well, this isn't good, is it? Mulverian's journal. Okay, maybe this can shed some light. I've settled down now, having renovated an abandoned cottage just outside Shadenhall. Having a comfy place to call my own is more than I could ever have dreamed of just a year or so ago. My memories still torture me though, even whilst awake. I doubt I'll ever be truly at peace. The people around here are reasonably friendly, but I'm keeping myself to myself on the whole. There is a pretty young Breton girl who seems to like popping by though. She's nice enough and though I'm often quite abrasive, she doesn't seem to care. I've started writing a book about my past in an effort to ease the pain. I'm beginning to get quite fond of the Breton girl. Adria she's called. She's one of the few humans I've ever befriended and when she's around the horrors of my past seem to melt away into bad dreams. She seems to sense I have much to hide about my past, but she never asks. I'm thinking of asking her to move in with me, I think she'd say yes. She's around here more often than not now anyway. She said yes. My sweet Adria, I honestly can't imagine life without her now. She's so gentle and bakes a delicious boar pie. My book is coming along quite well. I might even finish it by Rain's hand. My book is done. Adria's read it, she had looks of horror on her face at times. I don't think she realized how dark my past has been. Still, her opinion of me doesn't seem to have changed. In fact I think she loves me even more for having read it, and I her for that. Adria's been pushing me into getting my book published. I was wary at first, due to the nature of what I reveal in it, but I'm coming round to the idea. I've made some discreet inquiries with Makna, the owner of the bookstore in Shadenhall, and she seems willing to help get it printed. I'm now a published author. For my safety, as well as Adria's, I've not used my real name, but Ilnori. Hopefully this will arouse less suspicion, especially if, or rather when, some people who may still be looking to kill me read it. It seems the Dark Brotherhood has a secret sanctuary in Shadenhall. Had I known, I would have chosen somewhere else to settle, for they would certainly come after me if they knew who I was, in order to fulfill the contract they have on my life. However now that I'm with Adria I'm unwilling to move. She loves it here and although she would no doubt go with me wherever I went, I haven't got the heart to tear her away. I've taken to doing a bit of research about the Brotherhood, so that I might better avoid them. Most of what I've heard is idle gossip, which I seriously doubt it to be true. What reliable information I have been able to gather relates to the Black Sacrament, used to summon an agent of the Brotherhood, in order to make a contract with them. It involves creating an effigy from a heart, a skull, bones, flesh, two sprigs of lavender, three green stained cup caps and the pulp of four monkshood plants. This should be encased in a bolt of cloth in the form of a humanoid. Then using a dagger, that has had its blade rubbed with nightshade, the effigy must be stabbed repeatedly whilst uttering, Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. All this should be done in a circle of candles. Once the ceremony is performed, an agent of the Brotherhood will make contact, usually coming when you are asleep. Blessed Mara, Adria's pregnant. I don't know what to say. I guess I'll have to start thinking about making a crib and such like for it. Hmm. Kind of a cheery end after all this Dark Brotherhood stuff. Maybe not so cheery if this is Adria. Shades Reaver. What is Shades? A damp note. Um. Damp note. We've managed to find a suitable place to hold the traitor, south of his cottage in a cave on the slopes that look down the river valley. Once you've finished having your fun with his woman, we'll finish having our revenge on him for what he did to us. Oh dear. Okay, south of his cottage in a cave on the slopes. That's where we're going next then I suppose. That armor. Shadow armor. I like it. It looks good. I wouldn't want heavy armor but... Could maybe have a look at it anyway. Ooh, light shadow armor. Okay. And I'm over encumbered. Great. Let's see. 
So the heavy is very heavy. And the light? If I compare it to this. Oh gosh it's quite heavy compared to that. Um. Yeah I guess I like it. Don't know how they're gonna feel with me using their armor, but... What are they gonna do about it? Okay. And I think the heavy one isn't gonna be much use for you. Right, I'm carrying too much now. I wanted to get you out of heavy. There were the guys outside though, we can see what they had. So is this Adria then? Don't ask me why Mazoga. But I have this very strange urge. To take her heart. And her skull. And maybe even her ribcage. Yeah I don't know why I have that urge either. Let's ignore it. I think that's everything in here. An exquisitely crafted ring. The ring has been skillfully crafted and amidst the set purple jewel, the letter K seems to be apparent. Ha. Huh. Okay. Well. How odd. That's so sad. Yeah. So. These guys, what were they wearing? Light, okay. I might give that to you Mazoga. And. Oh, you already looted him. Okay well let's hold off on that for now. So south is gonna be this way. Wait, is that south? Yeah, north is that way so this is south. And they're in a cave. What is it? A wolf. Did you just one shot that wolf? Fair enough, glad you're on my side. In a cave they said. On the slopes. Do be careful here Mazoga, it is quite steep. Hmm. Looking for a cave. What is that? Oh, it's a waterfall. What do you want to bet we've gone right past it? I'm not seeing any caves. Oh uh, yeah, let's not fall off the edge, eh? Do you want to carefully climb down into the cave below? Oh. Yes, I do. Okay. Ooh. Lots of people. Okay. My health is not great right now. And I'm out of healing potions, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Can I very quickly make any? What does human blood do? Drain fatigue, resist poison, vampire blood feeding. Let's see here. Okay, I made a few. So let's see. Damage health on. Yeah, that's already there. And healing. Restore health. Okay. Good. Right. I think I'm gonna send you in first. There's rats as well. I'm gonna heal myself a bit with this spell as well. Okay, go. You're the boss. Ooh, no 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 no. Do not knock me off. 
You ass. You ass, you ass. This ends here. Ack. My god. I don't know what I would do without you. I'm gonna take some spare of that as well. Did the others fall off? No, I don't think they did. Ooh. Mazoga, come on. What are you wearing? Are you wearing the heavy one? Go get them. You're the boss. Yeah, I am. You're not doing it though. Interesting. Go get them. You're the boss. Ha! Ha! Yeah! Oh! Ow, 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 ow. And then just rat. Any interesting things in here? No? Okay. There's a door. And there's a passageway. Cavern depths. Let's see what's this way first. I can hear more. Do you want to go after them while I look around? You're the boss. Ah, why do you always come straight for me? I can't see. Let's get this over. Okay, let's do this. Oh no, that was longer than I expected. Ow. To greet you or eat you. Shut up. If I was actually any good at stealth, then I could sneak up on them and stab them in the back. That would be nice. I don't think I'm gonna be able to. What's that? They've already heard me, unless they're hearing you, but go get them. You're the boss. And hopefully I don't get so cornered that I just fall over. Die! Ha. Mizoga, are you down? I think you need to give me some lessons, Mizoga. I am terrible. I mean in my defense these guys are professionals. I need an enchantment on my sword. Claymore of fire. Well it's a claymore so no. Not gonna happen. Oh of course I am.
Right. You go and get them, Mazoga. You're the boss. Hi. Do you come after me because I'm a weaker target? Royal Warblade? Mare. Still very dark. At least this dagger is enchanted. So I can use this. Only problem is it's so short. So it doesn't have much reach. You are a lot quieter in that you know, even if it's heavy armor. Go get them. You're the boss. Come on where I can see you. Why? I'm stuck. This is the time fall down and bleed to death. My god, there's like nothing I can do against them. I'm terrible. And they've got long swords. Okay. We have a door. Um. Okay. Die, you I'm just warming up here. What's the matter, getting tired? You do look good in that, you know. Uh, nuggets I'll take. Okay. I wonder if he was in that room then, that we missed. That we didn't go in. Right at the beginning. Right so here. I cannot bloody see. And we've attracted something already. Swift hunting, friend. A rat. I saw some mud crabs by the water. And a chest. I'll take the gold. What is it? Have you seen a lamb tray? Right. How many are we dealing with here? I see someone over there. I can hear. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's a lot of people. Um. Stay there, Mazoga. You're the boss. This might be a really bad idea. Oh my gods, they can hear me. They're too good. They're professionals. I've never dealt with professionals before. Okay, go and kill someone. Please. Go and kill someone. You're the boss. Oh. Not again, not again. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Help me, Mazoga. Mazoga, help. Help. Help me.
I need a weapon from you. Something long and enchanted I would think. 30. Can I manage 30? There is red wave. Drain health 15 points for 6 seconds on strike. Let's give red wave a try. I don't know how this is gonna go. Go. You're the boss. I'll join in after. Am I supposed to kill Rez? Oh my gosh. This ends here. Ah! Probably. Good evening. Hi, Mountain Rangers. Go away. Rise Do not to the come borders back. in the north and east. I could dispel some things. Poisons that they put on me. I could also go invisible. To sneak up. But I don't really think that's gonna be enough. So, um. I'm gonna have you. Go in. You're the boss. I'm just gonna stay out of sight as best I can. Because you're a lot better at this than me. And you're unconscious. And they've seen me. The only other thing I can think of is if we can like lure one or two at a time. Maybe with a magic spell? Or if I get just one to see me? You stay there. You're the boss. I could also attempt. Uh, hello. No, I don't think invisibility is gonna be enough. It kinda requires me to kill something in one or maybe two hits. Otherwise, what's really the point? Better cut down on the air. Starting to see safe, safe travel. Huh, bye. Okay. No, they didn't see me. <laughs> Whatever it was, it's gone now. Okay, fine. I'm gonna try invisibility. See how that goes. Forty-five seconds. <laughs> I've attracted the others, I've attracted the others. Help, help, help. Help. Mazoga, it's up to you now. Let's get this over with. <laughs> I'm just warming up, you pathetic worm. Whoa! <laughs> Okay, I need to take some things. Agility. Dispel. Fortify health with the exploration elixir. That might be necessary. Ah! 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 Okay, they've seen me. They've seen me, I think. Have they? Well, one of them has. Oh gods. Come on, Mazoga. Okay. Well, I can take care of a rat. Let's take. Exploration. Show me. <laughs> Stop shooting me. I could try and get the archer. Where is the archer? Do your worst. Oh gods, Mazoga. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Damage health and silence. 
Dispel. Cure poison. Have I been poisoned? I don't really know. What I don't have is a healing potion. Oh, Mazoga High. Die! Come on! Take that! No, no, no. Whoa. Bailey, Master Thief, Master of Stealth, Master of the Fighters Guild. Mazoga, did you just loot me? 